What is up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Cameron here with another video. Today we're kind of doing kind of some there. Kind of, 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 kind of. We're doing something fun today. Kelsey here is doing her first oil change. She's never done an oil change before. Uh, she needed an oil change on her car. I figured this would be the best time to do it. So, have you ever done an oil change? You've never done an oil change before, right? No. Yeah, so this should be a lot of fun, right? So much fun. <laughs> so yeah, let's get to it. We're gonna start with jacking the car up. Uh, we're gonna actually put it on the hoist. We're lucky enough to have the hoist here. And it's gonna make life a little easier. Kelsey's dressed in her uniform. That way she doesn't get a little dirty. That would suck if she got her nice clothes dirty. So yeah, let's, uh, let's get to it. This one? Yep. Until the wheels come off the ground, stop. Keep going a little more. Keep off the ground. Stop. Now what you do is come back here. Push on the wheel to make sure it's so you can move fall. Uh, we can leave it like that. Pop the hood. Well, you, it's popped, but you just have to open it. All right, so where does the oil go in? You know where the oil goes in, right? That's how you check your oil. Where does the oil go into? Oh, um, it goes into here. All right, so take it off. Oh, Where'd it go? Did you just lose it? It's right there, I just can't reach it. You lost your oil cap. It's right there, I see it. I got it. Oh, no. I got it. I got it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Well, I can stay up. Okay, so raise the car up again. That button. We're gonna go high enough that we can go under it. Okay, so you hear that last click, right? Hold this down. <clears throat> don't go like, don't like shove it down, but like slowly go down with it. And then see how it stopped? Oh. They're locks. Do you know where the oil comes out of? No. Let's, I'm let's take a look. See if you can find it. <laughs> All right, so your oil comes out of here. Yeah, that's your oil drain plug. So your oil, you know your dipstick? Yeah. Your dipstick pokes into this. This is your oil pan. This is where the oil comes out. Okay, so we need a pan that will hold the oil that comes out. Okay. So you want that right where it drains, right? Because that's we want the oil to go in here, right? Okay. So next thing. We're gonna need a socket to fit that. So we're gonna grab a toolbox. Okay. All right. So, bottom drawer. Yep. So it's gonna be one of these guys here. Yep. That's the right one. Yep. Where it has oh this side. So there's this button on the top of it. Push it. There you go. And then put it on. There you go. Okay. So that's gonna. So you gotta figure out which way this goes, right? So whatever way it pushes hard, so twist it. So that's lefty, loosey, righty, tighty, right? Yeah, so you lift it up and you turn it this way. Yeah, so will... okay, so what is that? Are you tightening or loosening? That would be tightening. Okay, so this right here changes the direction it goes. And that would go this way and that would be loosening. loosening. Now put this on there and you just want to crack it. You don't want to take the bolt off, you just want to crack it. Okay, you pull things. Put this on last. Holy Where did you go last? That one on her. Tell them they're a bunch of idiots. Holy shit. That should never be that tight. Oh. No, I just put my whole body on it. You remember how I showed you that this thing goes up and down? Yeah. Raise it up so you're close to it. That way the oil doesn't have to go from here all the way down. It can be just a little bit. Okay, so then tighten the knob. All right, come to this side here. And then you just wanna loosen it. But you gotta be careful, because once you get all the way off, 
it's gonna start coming out. So once you feel that the bolt's out, you wanna pull your hand like this. Just look at me. So you're loosening, loosening, loosening. You feel like it's out, you wanna go. Or else you're gonna get oil all over your hands. We're about to find out how good our pullout game is. Okay, you put your hand up here. Huh? Put your hand up there so you don't drip oil everywhere. Got a little bit of oil on your hands. Still a rookie, but not bad. So we're gonna let that drain. So while that drains, we gotta get your oil filter off. I loosened it. So now oil is gonna come down out of it. It's gonna get on your arm, or your wow. hand, on your hand. Go at it from an angle, yeah, like that, yeah. Okay, after some technical difficulties, we got the oil filter off. Now we need an oil filter. So grab that filter. Bring it with you. So here's your filter. Before you screw that filter on, you need to put a little bit of oil on this ring. Let it drip on your hand a little bit. And then put it on the ring. you put it back on there. Before you put it on there, you wanna make sure there's no gasket from the last one. So you know the gasket you just lubed up? You wanna make sure the old gasket's not, gasket's there. not there. It's not there. So just twist it on. You twist it until it touches, until you feel it touch. Mm -hmm. Okay, so twist it until you feel it touch. It's touching. Okay, so now you go three quarters of a turn. So normally you look at the filter and see how there's like pictures on it? See there's a picture on this side here. It's like a garbage can or something. What I normally do is I'll look at that garbage can and then I'll go three quarters of the way, so like roughly here. I'll try and get that picture to line up over here. Should I untwist it a little bit? No, just twist it. Just twist it to your tightest because I don't think you'll be able to get it three quarters of a turn. Okay, so I pulled your drain plug. Cleaned it off over here. So see how there's a, a washer on it? See how there's a washer on it? Yeah, that thing in your hand there? Yeah. That's a crush washer. Okay. So you put it on there, and then when you put it on to your drain area again, mm -hmm. you're gonna wanna make sure that gasket is centered. It looks really centered. Look at me go. Yeah, where'd it go? Okay, so you grab your socket and wrench again. Same size. This way. Right, yep. Now you're gonna tighten it. Pretty much line it up with that orange side. Yeah. It. You have successfully changed your filter, drained the oil, now, put new oil. now you put oil in it and you're done. Cool. So now you remember where we found where you put the oil into, right? So put the funnel into where the oil goes. Oh, you got oil everywhere. Oh, was I not supposed to? That's okay. And now just pour that in, not super fast, but you can go like at a decent speed. How's the oil changing process so far? Fun. Fun? We should get you to change a set of tires. <gasps> that would be fun. Winter's coming up. Yeah. Would you guys like to see Kelsey change her set of tires one day? That'd be kind of fun. Can I put all of this in? Yeah, all of it. Start the car up. Let it run for, hey, you can take it off now. Pretty much done. Yeah, see how you're like right there? Actually, yeah, you're like right there. That's where you wanna be? You wanna be up here. Oh, So we're gonna put a little bit more oil in. You have successfully changed your oil. Cool. Would you do it again? Sure. It's not that hard, eh? No, that's pretty easy. Yeah. I just struggle getting some of yeah, sometimes it can be a little tough when you go to shops that just don't give a crap. Alrighty guys, so that is it for today's video. Kind of a short one, might be a long one. I'm not sure how long it's gonna be, but uh, Kelsey has officially changed her oil for the first time. If you guys like this video, slap, slap it a like, throw a thumbs up, I don't know, what do you say? Give it a thumbs up. Give it a thumbs up. I don't do this often. Give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like this, we kind of have 
an old shop to kind of do fun, sting, fun things with. Winter is coming up. Let us know in the comments down below if you want to see her change a set of tires. That'd be kind of fun. I'm just saying, get her working the old uh, tire machine there. And then she can balance as well, do a full set. We can spend a whole day here. That'd be pretty fun. Kelsey also has a, a bunch of stuff that she needs done to the car. And I told her I would do it while I'm at work, but maybe we'll just do it together and uh, we could make a series out of it. Get Kelsey working on her car a little bit more. That'd be kind of fun. I'd enjoy that. I don't know how good the content's gonna be, but it's someone that has literally no experience. I caught her yawning has no experience in the automotive industry, so it could be a fun video. So anyways, that is it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed. We'll see you guys in the next one.